Hey, this is going to be a video on what you need to start trout fishing. What I use I use a solo 14 pound rod with 8 pound test. And pretty much all I need that'll do just about everything. Trout, bass, perch, chub, small fish like that, and sometimes even bigger ones, but you have to really play them out and Takes a little more skill to do that, and that's the rod. Now, moving on to what else you need. You should also have a knife on you. You should have pliers and a knife. Wrong side. Knife. Pliers good for taking the hook out of the fish's mouth. Knife good for cutting if you keep it. Keep that on you. Tackle. For trout, I normally use small stuff like some spinners. I actually always use spinners. Different color spinners. I got orange and yellow and got some gold and more gold and got a big bass spinner here. These ones work good um in deep water. Chuck them out there, reel them in nice and slow, and drop down there. It's gonna move like this through the water. This attracts them. A worm on the back of these works really good, and then I have some other small stuff for like um, you should probably clean this out someday. But I got little rooster tails and stuff, those work good for creeks like right off like the strong channels. Like if you go right on the outside edge of them, that normally works pretty good. And we got like a master cast, and we got these little things. I don't know what the frig they're called, they seem to work pretty good. And after that stuff, and we got size 6, um, just cheap hooks, I get them for like 2 bucks at Walmart and then I'm gonna go bass, I don't wanna bring something bigger like jigs and spoons and different cups and bigger spinners and sometimes I even throw one of these guys out, I can't remember what they're called off the top of my head but these work pretty good, you can get them at Walmart you can pack 3 and 5 for like 6 bucks, they work pretty good for bass and sometimes like these like just these rubber worms these little white white yellow red pink guys they work pretty good and when you're putting out on a spinner you all you need is you put one of these swivels on put one of those on and then after that you're gonna go ahead and take your spinner and clip it onto the swivel and then if you and then if it's you're finding a hard time it's not going out far enough put one of these little split shots on those things will just go make it go just that extra little bit and get different sizes like I got those ones and I got half and I got those little small ones and I got bigger ones and these things off there and these little guys work good